In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to resize and how to move an image. The important thing to remember when you're talking about resizing versus moving an image is the orientation of the handles of the picture. To illustrate this, I'll select the picture and you can see that it received boxes around the edge of its image that are called handles. As I said, the first thing I'm going to do is resize it. And in order to resize the picture and keep its perspective, I need to make sure that I place my cursor over a corner handle. And any corner handle will work. So I'll place it over the lower right hand corner and I simply click and drag towards the middle of the picture to resize it. Notice that the perspective stayed the way I wanted it to. Be very careful that you don't grab a side or top or bottom handle. If I do this, then I'm actually distorting the picture. I'll go up to the Edit menu and choose Undo so that we leave the perspective of the picture the way we want it. Now, in order to move this picture, I should probably have some text available. So I'm going to go ahead and hit Return and type in a little bit of text here. Okay, so I have a picture and it's above my text, but if I want to move that picture to below my text, and notice when I typed, I actually hit enter after I typed to make sure that I would have some room to continue to work. If I want to move this picture from the top of the text to the bottom of the text, I simply grab the picture in the middle and drag it until I see my cursor down below my text. When I let go, my picture will move from above the text to below the text.